Hey guys, it's Dr. Sarah Gottfried, and I wanted to talk about the heart for a minute. It's amazing to me that less than half of women recognize that cardiovascular disease is the number one killer. They think first about breast health, and they think about their weight. They don't think about their heart. And what I realized, you know, after, after the past 25 years of working as a gynecologist and practicing precision medicine for women is that there's some major differences between men and women when it comes to heart disease. And one of them is a major sex difference, which is pregnancy. And so I've, I've evolved in my thinking about this. I used to sort of, you know, I was taught when I went through obstetrics and gynecology residency that, you know, you should pay attention to lipids and you should help patients eat better and you should do the usual lifestyle things. But I was never taught that pregnancy is a stress test it's a really important test for women in terms of looking at some of our vulnerabilities. So in fact, what the literature shows is that preeclampsia, pregnancy induced hypertension, pregnancy induced uh, diabetes or gestational diabetes, preterm birth, having a, a low birth weight baby for gestational age, all of those things are actually major markers of cardiovascular disease. And so I think we need to really understand that there's these sex differences between men and women, and they really impact our risk of cardiovascular disease because women are often dismissed uh, for symptoms that they're having of cardiovascular disease. This is well documented. In fact, it's even shown that women who see a female clinician when they're having cardiovascular symptoms have better outcomes, they have better survival than if they see a male physician. Now, I'm not bashing on male physicians, I just think all of us need to be part of the rising tide of understanding about the risk of cardiovascular disease and thinking about pregnancy as a stress test. So if you had a tough pregnancy, if you had any of those diagnoses that I mentioned, the hypertension, the preeclampsia, the diabetes, preterm labor, uh, small for gestational age baby, those are markers of future cardiovascular disease. So your clinician may not know this about you, and I, I want you to know about it so that you can do something about it, so that we can start to address the cardiovascular disease 20, 30 years before you end up in the emergency room with a heart attack. So please join me, spread the word, like this particular video, uh, leave a comment, leave any questions that you have, and please share it with others. Let's get this message out. Thanks, you guys.